okay right uh, now is it okay oh you should have i should have checked the chat earlier only arka has written no sound now is it okay audio hai abhi audio video all fine tell me yes or no right perfect okay so i will have to repeat what i was saying i was talking about the people who did the homework yesterday for editorial okay very good try prabuda has written the summary and then we have jyotsna anand kartik paras ajay and anurag hema manoj okay these guys excellent job i was saying very good that you answer to my questions for the homework whether i give you idioms whether i give you uh, phrases you reply back in the comment section this will help you remember for the long term so excellent guys all those who did the homework yesterday right now yesterday was last day to fill ecgc po form i think many would have done that just to inform you all ecgc po we are coming up with new course which is practice plus descriptive both together if you buy this course you will get descriptive english also ecgc po plus the practice sessions also so you can use my code which is harshita for maximum discount on this course right more than 40% other than that i want to inform there are other courses udc mains super practice batch is going on uh, for your live practice sessions yes me full full it is not theory it's full practice sessions in udc mains then we have repeaters batch for people who don't clear mains udc mains cracker course assistant mains also to inform you that we daily have tna monday to saturday 8 am after my class 7 am editorial we have descriptive english complete course separately we have grade b so many courses according to your preferences your needs according to whatever you will be writing whichever exam you select for this year targeting whichever exam now you know the best plan on all about is super elite wherein you can access multiple courses right so if you buy super elite under it you can access multiple courses whether you talk about descriptive practice batch uh, winners batch foundation anything that comes insurance related banking related course right so that is the best one on super elite uh, the on all about super elite plan use code harshita and enroll to this one then you don't have to worry guys you get topic test also you get mocks also uh, you get improvement test concept videos lps everything is there in super elite okay instead of buying again and again buy one super elite and then continue your preparation for the year target whatever exam you want now guys anything you buy on all about use my code we have a course for jaiib also you can tell your friends jaiib and rbi grade b separate course also on telegram do follow me for class updates for pdfs this is my group Okay, Harshita Kurana, the grammar girl. On Instagram, I am also there. So Harshita dot the grammar girl on Instagram. Okay, both these places do follow. Right. Hmm. ये रट चुका है ना आप सबको super elite best है super elite best है but yeah we still we are required to tell you this inform because if there is any new candidate should know. Let's start with guys the previous day vocabulary very quickly. जल्दी से बताना है येस्टरडे वी डिड दिस वर्ड्स मैम मैम मेरा भी होमवर्क आप चेक नहीं किया गार्गी आई डिंट सी योर कमेंट हाँ बिकॉज आई चेक ऑल द आंसर्स आई डिंट सी योर कमेंट्स येस्टरडे इन द होमवर्क यू वंस चेक इफ यू हैव कमेंटेड आई एम नॉट एबल टू सी योर कॉमेंट या बिकॉज रेस्ट आई हैव आई डोंट नो वेर यू हैव आंसर्ड Uh, it is for editorial. If you are saying, I was not able to see. Uh, I did not see any of your comments. Otherwise, I would have checked. Huh. Manoj, your name I have already taken. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Manoj, I have checked yours already. I have taken your name also. Huh. At the hem means means at the controlling position. Correct. Huh. At the hem is officially controlling. okay at a controlling position running an organization controlling an organization at the hem you are in the leadership position okay okay obscurity means when there is no clarity okay no clarity there is obscurity bereft is lack of something lack of okay bereft correct obscurity is also being unknown 
uh, when you treat something as not so important okay that is also obscurity we can say tweaked is changed when you make small changes is tweaked theek hai correct next is disdain uh when do we use this word in negative we use it we know that but when do we use this word disdain meaning disdain is feeling that somebody is not good enough to be respected okay disrespect right okay next nepotism is favoritism okay favoritism basically you show favoritism towards your families friends um in a situation right nepotism where you have the power you use your power and your influence you use your influence and power to favorite uh, to to of course favor your uh, known people biasness right complacence means when you are self satisfied self satisfaction is complacence when you are when you don't want to improve or work harder you are self satisfied with yourself you show complacence okay fiefdom what is fiefdom guys vanshvad yeah so uh, it is again a noun word like we say kingdom we say fiefdom okay a territory which is controlled by a particular person or a group Okay, flattering. When you flatter someone, basically, अच्छा okay. homework में Indian article, Indian Express article was tough. Okay, I will check it. Flattering means full of praise, full of compliments. Okay, trying to, ah, uh, trying to flatter. When you give too many compliments, you try to praise somebody a lot. Miss happenings. Okay. accidents small accidents mishappenings small accidents are mishaps mishaps is small accidents mishappening right actually mishap is short form of mishappening only correct chalo hmm. now uh, these were very basic words which we did and you should remember tweak for example change we see it so regularly in editorial nepotism you know complacence is a noun word which is a name of a quality being self satisfied see words are very important any of these you can find in your vocabulary any of these you can find in other articles that you read when you follow these regularly your vocab automatically improves okay whatever words we discuss from editorial are extremely important chal now let's start <clears throat> i don't remember if you will ask me what is the tone of this article i read so many articles per day you have to ask me on the same day uh, uh, gargi i'm sorry i'll not be able to answer you so sometimes guys when you will ask me okay what was that tone you read two a day i read two newspapers or three newspapers and so many articles i would not remember particular tone you will have to send me and ask i cannot answer you randomly if you ask me what was that tone okay chalo flattery also means fake compliments manoj you can say that because you're trying to you're full of praises yeah you're trying to flatter it can be fake compliments you can you're trying to please somebody by giving you by giving compliments by praising them highly right huh. okay now today's article is again from indian express today all three is indian express even suggested articles because this newspaper i found something different so i thought i'll give you that only fuller care fuller care means the complete care now i want actually i also have my views regarding this and i thought i will discuss with all of you okay ha chalo fuller care means complete care no no guys i am not scolding don't be sorry i am just telling you in a day i read articles but when you ask me with in between classes and in when i am reading so much you ask me a particular article title and you ask me the tone i will obviously not be able to remember okay from each because there's so much i have read now by the end of the day next day if you will ask me i will definitely not so whenever you are confused 
you send that article no don't send it on the group send it to a friend discuss it and you can confirm directly to with me on telegram okay that is better chalo uh, guys we'll start reading fuller care means complete care not leaving out anything pura care theek hai okay so recently what happened correct this is about definitely the medical care we are talking about okay theek hmm. hai uh, article error i will see like here today's evening class questions will be a bit different i'll try to definitely get rc and close test is pending so evening close test you will see like here okay hmm. now guys inaugurating the who global center for tradition medicine at jamnagar in gujarat on tuesday pm narendra modi talked about the possibilities offered he talked about the therapeutic approaches that are different from allopathic guys how many of you understand the difference therapeutic and all allopathy how many of you know this difference therapeutic and allopathy to mention it in the comments have you heard this difference do you know this difference right uh allopathic is the conventional the normal treatment suppose we are not feeling well we have got fever we'll pop a pill we'll take a tablet we'll, we will you know it is a conventional method with drugs right with a tablet with drugs you try to um uh, cure the disease right so a drug which will have an opposite effect obviously so that is the normal conventional treatment okay uh what is what is uh, this one therapeutic treatment therapeutic is because pm modi he talked about the possibilities which are offered by therapeutic uh, therapeutic treatment it is not the conventional having pills or having drugs okay uh, therapeutic is related to treatment of diseases or disorder by different methods other curative methods right remedial agents it is not by drugs it is not by the use of tablets or drugs it is by other remedial measures right uh, so it tries to make the person overall healthier uh, have has a healing effect therapeutic is having a healing effect right right like, like counseling sessions correct okay for example therapeutic treatment anybody who is facing mental issues will be given to uh, will be given a therapeutic treatment like that okay it is very different from just having the normal tablets or drugs which is allopathic system you know their emphasis on holistic care holistic means complete care instead of just treating the one disease or just the symptoms when you give holistic care means you are treating the whole person okay ha so 
makes traditional medicine system strong in dealing with challenges which are posed by which are uh, caused by modern lifestyle see now we live a life where we face major challenges now you all know in your family also you have heard among the circles your circle also major challenges guys lifestyle disorder why we call them lifestyle disorder our lifestyle has changed change, right we sit in front of laptops it is sedentary lifestyle uh, full day there is no physical activity there is lack of physical activity uh, if we talk about our uh, conversation or our interaction with nature is also minimal right so our lifestyle modern lifestyle disorders people are obese they are eating a lot of junk food obe obesity is when you are when you gain weight okay hmm. okay then you have disorders like diabetes okay so obesity okay fatness when you gain weight when you are very fat overweight okay so overweight so these are the major diseases now in today's life and time you all know you have heard like uh, the we we are facing problems like diabetes obesity these are common lifestyle disorders we are facing okay now conversations any talk about medical pluralism what is medical pluralism suppose you are unwell you just don't take a tablet nowadays what we do is we also suppose if if you have caught uh, if you have a throat infection just take an example throat infection hota hai aap kya karte ho throat infection mein you will take a tablet that is okay other than that there are a variety of medical treatments you will also probably get into ayurveda treatment ayurveda uh, solution or you will your your grandparents or your mother or father will tell you to have tea uh by like with with, uh, with you know all that uh, uh, putting all that spices garam masala and you know uh, so you 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 get into a different variety of treatment it is not just one single so there is pluralism there are different medical traditions there are different medical practices that are there available okay so the new medical center objective of the uh, the, the objective of this new medical center that they have come up with in jamna nagar in gujarat at jamna nagar in gujarat is welcome okay this is the objective so that there is holistic treatment of the person overall person is healed right haldi dood you take tablet haldi dood vapor inhalation you take you do a lot of things right ha motapa ambani san manoj motapa i will say for myself also it is a very common problem obesity is very very common in today's time right theek hai so guys inaugurating the center at jamna nagar in gujarat prime minister talked about possibilities what are the possibilities what are the options what are the choices that therapeutic approach give us that are different from normal treatment allopathic is normal treatment having medicine you know so their emphasis was we need complete care of the person holistic care okay ha huh. and that also makes traditional systems particularly strong in dealing with challenges see traditional medicine system is strong when you want to deal with obesity disorder like diabetes you need medicines right uh, conversations on medical pluralism means there are a lot of talks about how we are in a society or we are in a place where we have you can say multiple multiple dif different practices treatments okay available there are different approaches also medical approaches treatments multiple institutions okay for example you can combine biomedicine with traditional medicine okay so you know how people are dealing with illness has also changed they navigate they have their home remedies like you said haldi wala dood if you you got throat infection you have home remedies you have evidence based remedies yeah so there is so much of variety you have religious healing okay some people will put that what what do they put guys that tikka here okay it will be all well that is religious healing also ye sab karte hai na hum so it is a mixture it is pluralism medical pluralism kitni sari practices there are so many practices available theek hai right ha so acha i like your question do they say new medical center is about different methods they say new medical center is for holistic treatment okay holistic means complete and yeah it will include a variety it will include a variety of treatments clear ha huh, they put vibhuti yeah 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 we are i remember so if you get throat throat take some people do this no religious healing also they will put vibhuti here on your throat okay that you will be fine now right manjot you are on a diet plan with exercise i don't know how you are able to handle 
How many people are here on a diet plan? Okay, my fault. Arun, I am sorry. And thank you for correcting me. It is okay, no? I learned from you also. Did I say? Okay. Jamnagar, not Jamnanagar, I said. I said Jamnanagar. I am sorry, sorry, sorry. Jamnagar. Jamnagar at Jamnagar in Gujarat. It is Jamnagar in Gujarat. Vyari, you are Vyari, you are already so thin. Again, diet plan. Elakya saying never. Okay. See, I to I means it is an idiom which is asked in your exam also once. See, I to I means agree. Agree on something. Okay? When you see I to I means you agree with someone. Right. Show musk. Okay. Okay. Very soon you will see musk guys. Now, they could pave the way for a healthcare ecosystem in which healing approaches based on diverse knowledge systems learn from and complement each other. Okay. They means, they could pave the way means the new, you know, one of the objectives, uh, conversations on medical pluralism. Pluralism means using different approaches, using different medical approaches, practices. Okay. That can help us, that will make our healthcare ecosystem better okay and we have diverse knowledge variety of knowledge systems we can learn from and they should go together well complement each other so if there is one approach we are following it should it should complement the other one right um there must be thorough careful examination stock taking is basically counting goods okay but here stock taking means we need to see why practitioners, people who practice doctors or nurses or, uh, you know, whoever studies medicines, people who practice this different medical systems, why they don't agree with each other. Okay. That includes, we should clear any doubts that people have. Also, we should resolve uh, differences if these people have. Okay. If there are regulatory deficits, if there are lack in regulations, if there is, uh, you know, problems like these, we should solve. Because... Writer says that these, whether you talk about therapeutic, allopathic, they should complement each other. They should work or go together well. Okay. But practitioners today, they don't agree to eat with each other. Why that is the case, we should be able to clear that doubts. Okay. Hmm. Next. There is some very interesting data. Guys, data regarding what medicines Indians use particularly. Okay, which form of medicine Indians use?
when it is unsubstantiated claims means something you say okay is true without any proof without any evidence you are saying it okay claims means when you make a claim you say that something is true without any evidence unsubstantiated with no substance no no proof acha uh, one doubt that you have last sentence this would involve clearing misapprehensions doubts but also uh, and equally importantly okay this would involve clearing misapprehensions but also is here to show contrast plus additional okay but also and equally importantly this you read together okay good question that you have asked me together they are used here okay but also and equally importantly ironing out means there are two things we need to do okay first we should clear doubts but also if there are any regulation differences or the lack in regulations that also be important that is also very important to clear okay that is also very important to solve okay chalo this paragraph who data what does it say 65 to 70 percent people in india use traditional therapies in their lives okay the amount of business that uh, is coming through ayurveda yoga natural therapy unani siddha homeopathy industry has gone six times up in the past eight years homeopathy i don't know why how people believe uh in match even i have visited and have uh, homeopathy even i have considered guys they give that white color uh, small small tablets which are very very sweet you remember so as a child i liked to go to homeopathy doctor is that the same they used to give that white tablets am, am i am i recalling it correctly tell me something like this in that small plastic box ha huh. very sweet tablets right hmm. so i used to go enjoy so much i used to actually fake that i am ill and i used to tell my mom take me to the homeopathic uh, clinic theek hmm. hai deficit means lack regulatory deficit means ha huh, regulatory deficit there is some lack in regulations okay uh, the regulations are not available uh, in uh, some, some medical practices regulatory deficit is there ilakya getting the point Uh, regulatory deficit meaning here in this context uh, regulations are not there okay there is lack of research regulations that is not there okay regarding a particular medicine or medicinal approach ha huh. so homeopathy i don't know but yeah it it works now you can see according to data only they are saying that the business of these ayurveda yoga natural therapy naturopathy homeopathy this industry has gone six times up okay huh. homeopathy is pure alcohol it seems okay theek hai but i don't know how effective they were anyways paradoxically means just the opposite paradox is something which is uh, two things which are exact opposite there is a lot of misinformation incorrect information okay regarding these practices these cures right and usually people who practice this okay um uh, are vilified they are maligned they are defamed unke bare mein bahut bura bola jata hai at times they are maligned at times people who practice other than normal medicine who practice this they are maligned okay now the part is the part of the blame must be led at the door of a section of practitioners why this happens why they are maligned why people talk negative about them is because some practitioners some doctors who you follow these they give claims they make big claims without proof okay Uh, so without proof you can't say but they make big claims without proof that is a problem okay mm. for cancer also do they use homeopathy yeah see people i think ha huh, probably like some people who for whom it suits it works they start believing it now see for instance baba ramdev now i am very against is is there any baba ramdev fan here i am against baba ramdev during the pandemic what did he do he tried to exploit okay use mass anxiety people were so anxious guys they were so worried they were so nervous and he used that okay uh, by making wildly inaccurate claims he said for the products manufactured by his ayurvedic pharmacy patanjali ayurved he make huge big claims right i don't know people actually believed him and i don't know why so many people follow him also ha theek hai ha so even i am against okay baba ramdev means what do i say 
and the products are also such inferior products. Have you used it? I used once. Patanjali Ayurveda. I told my mom never to buy these products. And I never buy Patanjali. Okay. Arun, are you the biggest fan? I will I will faint here if you will say that. Patanjali, guys, the products are so inferior. I've used and tried. Okay, this is my personal opinion. If you use it, your choice. But otherwise, I don't know why. He used people's emotions, anxiety. And he made such wrong claims. He said, claim is when you make a claim, you say something without any proof. Okay, regarding his own products, his own Ayurvedic pharmacy, Patanjali. Okay. Huh. We are saying I used shampoo. Inferior products. Very inferior. Okay. Disparge means to talk about something in a very critical way. So obviously the yoga guru. He obviously criticized Ninda Karna, Bolte, Ninda Karna. So he dispatched the allopathic system. Okay. During the COVID time, he was making full use of people's anxiety, using their emotions. He said he criticized the allopathic system. Okay. The system where tablets are given. Okay. The normal conventional system of treatment. He, uh, he actually uh, criticized it. Okay. He said it is useless. Okay. Uh, it will not give you results. It is useless. He said all that. There are videos also of him. Okay. And he said it is a farce system. Okay. It is a farce means um, it is a sham. It is it is fake. Okay. Uh, it is a farce system. Okay. Ridiculous. It is a waste of time also. The normal treatments are a waste of time, he said. And he also blamed. He alleged. He blamed that lakhs of people died also because of full treatment by doctors. Okay. Uh, he said it is a waste of time, this whole system, conventional system of giving you medicines and all. He said people died also because of the pre treatments of doctors. He claimed that reports of traditional medicine practitioners who prescribe, who suggest allopathic drugs and steroids are common. Okay. okay. Uh, so these are claims made by him. I don't know how you, you know, right, how honest that man is, but yeah. Okay. At the same time, the grouse of such physicians about being judged, okay, uh, deserves serious attention. How can you judge them? Okay. Chalo, read the next para. I will write the meanings for you till then. Efficacy, how efficient the product is, okay, allopathic medicine, the normal medicines, the drugs that we have, how efficient they are, right, amended, obviously you make minor changes, you amend the law. Next we have predicament, very common word again, unpleasant situation, embarrassing situation. Okay, so what does this para say? At the same time, the angry complaint of such physicians about being judged, how these are doctors are being judged, okay, uh, according to criteria designed primarily to make sure the efficiency of allopathic medicines deserve serious attention. The writer says the their complaints deserve attention that the way they are judged, okay. The National Commission for Indian System of Medicine Act 
does try to solve this predicament, this unpleasant situation. There was an act in which changes were made in 2021. This act, there were some changes made, amended. But accomplishing one of the major objectives of this law is what? To ensure the availability of quality professionals. There should be professionals, doctors, nurses. There should be quality medical professionals of Indian systems of medicine and the adoption of latest research. Okay, all this will take time. The major objective also of this law will take time. It will not be very smooth, not be very fast. All these takes time, right? So, when we adopt recent research according to, uh, a practice should be according to our latest research, recent research, and there should be quality available professionals who are well qualified. All this will take time, okay? So, right. Gopika, you have to, you have to, Follow me or you have to join my telegram group. There I share PDF every day. Okay. So let me tell you my telegram channel and group is there. You can easily find and there I share the PDF. Harshita Khurana, the grammar girl. Okay. If you are not able to find directly send hi to me. I will share the link also of the group. Okay. Okay. A growing body of scholarly literature. Guys, scholarly is which part of speech? Kisi ko pata scholarly kya hai? It is adverb, adjective, noun. Which is this word? Anybody who can give me correctly. Scholarly kya part of speech? A very important grammar lesson for you. Scholarly means learned, connected, connected with a lot of research, academic study. Okay. Uh -huh. Scholarly is... We are talking about noun word literature. It is adjective. It looks like adverb because it is ending in ly but it is adjective. Okay. Uh, connected with academic study. Connected with academic study. It is adjective. No, it is not. It looks like adverb vihari. Okay. Connected with academic research study. Right. Uh, you remember ly words certain look like adverb but they are actually adjectives. Uh, so scholarly literature today documents the efforts of a section of traditional medicine practitioners to sync the practices of these systems with modern research rules or protocols. Okay. To sync means to connect. So whatever practices are happening. Okay. Uh, uh, there is a lot of scholarly literature work done, uh, you know, study done where they are trying to obviously make a connect with of traditional pra medicine practitioners and the practices which are there based on the modern research protocols, right? There are studies done. There is a lot of research done, okay? And modern protocols means the, the norms that are there, the official procedures, the systems, norms, okay? Fixed, fixed uh, pattern, okay? So, the research norms, research procedures that are there to connect with these, huh, there are a lot of effort which is done. Regulatory bodies that regulate, okay? That bring regulations, that bring rules. And initiatives such as GCTM will do well. Means it is a good step. Uh, writer says it is a good step establishing of here in the first line we read no GCTM. Global Center for Traditional Medicine. It's a very good step writer says to rope in such professionals. To get in the best quality professionals. Okay. Uh, for uh, in this field in medicine. Right. Rope in means to convince, to persuade. When you open, you try to convince people to join them, okay, for an activity. Persuade them to do a task, okay. Uh, join a group, involved, get involved in something. So, these are good steps, the writer says, to convince good professionals, professionals, uh, you know, who are very skilled, right. So, this was your full para, fuller care. Elakya, uh, your doubt, I will come to previous para, last one, okay, which is your... Now, once more, you can definitely read. Take your time. Understand. People ask for efficacy evidence from allopathy. Okay. Uh, and still disbelieve it when they use totka. Correct. I totally agree. That is usually what they do. Okay. okay. So, I will talk about the last para once again for you, Elakya. But accomplishing one of the major objectives of this law will take time. What are the major objectives? See, in inverted commas, they have put the objective. Okay. But, you know, fulfilling, achieving the major objective of this law. Which law? The National Commission for Indian System of Medicine Act 2020. Its major objective is making available quality medical professionals. Okay. Of Indian systems of medicine. 
and adopting latest research all this will take time okay huh. so accomplishing this will take time what will take time accomplishing this particular target objective will take time it will not be very simple right what is the tone guys what will you say is the tone cooler care informative only informative any hmm uh yeah i did see guys few lines where it was very direct suggestive also but other than that what do you feel informative how many of you are saying informative only informative just let me yeah okay so even i feel in parts okay there were lines which were very suggestions were given okay but also there is one line where the writer praises that this is a good move by the government okay uh, to open up the center yeah overall if we say it is definitely informative overall if we say it is definitely informative correct sometimes guys see the tone will differ according to the paragraph also this happens a lot let me tell you tone will differ cha there are many grammar hint lessons here the first one which i want you to remember is scholarly is not adverb it is a word which is adjective okay we use it for a noun first grammar lesson today scholarly is adjective so there was one more which i was checking here ha huh, which we get to learn okay here right at jamnagar in gujarat so for smaller places in preposition chapter we do learn this at jamnagar in gujarat for bigger places we use in preposition for smaller places we use at simple grammar rule applied here okay uh, explanatory can you say in detail too much uh, details no i would not say explanatory doesn't look like that short paragraph informative information okay regarding the new center global center for traditional medicine that, that has come up possibility offered okay how it will help hmm yeah um yeah okay. guys understood here सिंक्रोपिन दीज आर फ्रेजेस ठीक है दीज टू ग्रामर लेसन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट राइट नाउ कमिंग टू द वोकेबलरी पार्ट देन आई विल टॉक अबाउट द फ्रेजेस एंड ईडियम्स ऑल्सो दैट वी लर्न फ्रॉम दिस आर्टिकल ठीक है चलो पोर्टेंट मीन्स पहला है आपका पोर्टेंट पोर्टेंट इज दिस नो एलोपैथिक पोर्टेंट हाँ स्ट्रॉन्ग पावरफुल equally strong and powerful system of medicine allo kya potent we say no potent drug very powerful one theek okay? hai so potent is strong and powerful clear hmm efficacy some things efficacy means how efficient how much what will be the result is it able to produce a desired result or no how efficient a system is right ability of something for example it can be a drug it can be a medical treatment to bring about the desired result to bring about the desired result the efficacy of something we judge the efficacy is it giving the is it producing the result which we want okay in hindi we say prabhavotpadakta prabhavotpadakta the efficacy 
so how efficient it is right predicament uh, now predicament is a difficult unpleasant situation in which you get stuck which is hard to get out of an unpleasant tough situation difficult situation okay in which you get in jisse jisse bahar nikalna bahut kathin hai bahut mushkil hai theek hai kathin sthiti okay fars the writer say, the uh, like baba ramdev said that this normal medicine system is fars fars means waste of time he went to say that it is a waste of time okay uh, something considered as a waste of time acha next is vilified vilified means they are questioned they are actually defamed okay verb vilified malign you you spoil the name of someone these no practitioners they are we write people are uh, people write unpleasant things about them kisi ka ninda karna malign them spoil their image write bad about them okay paradoxically paradoxical is two opposite things coming together okay it is adverb here paradoxically okay meaning virodha basi riti virodha basi two opposite virodh okay two opposite coming together right so in a way they were in two impossible situations containing two opposite of two opposite facts two opposite facts or two opposite situations okay ha they seem impossible to understand things that seem impossible to understand because they are based on two things which are totally opposite hmm. misapprehensions guys can we say potent is efficient potent is strong and powerful no jotsna theek hai misapprehensions are doubts very good uh, misapprehensions is your doubts when you are not sure about something you are mis misapprehension you have mistaken beliefs about something okay you have wrong idea about something you have doubts regarding a thing okay or you can also say guys mistaken beliefs you can say galat fehmi jisme bolna hai kisi cheez ke bare mein galat fehmi hona misapprehension okay a certain when you are certain something you make it certain you find the truth okay find out to confirm to make certain to find out what is correct theek hai pata lagana a certain is pata lagana find out what is right what is wrong okay disparage means disparage is obviously negative Dispar disparage actually p a r a it is to talk of something in a very critical way okay ha again to talk of something or someone in a very critical way dispar disparage in a very critical way same like ninda karna ninda karna criticize karna okay क्रिटिसाइज करना निंदा करना अच्छा दिस कॉम्प्लीमेंट स्पेलिंग कैन यू ऑल सी इट इज एम ई एन एल ई एम ई एन टी ओके सो दैट गोज टूगेदर वेल विद दी अदर थिंग कॉम्प्लीमेंट समथिंग द ब्लैक ड्रेस ओके द द गोल्डन शूज कॉम्प्लीमेंट द ब्लैक ड्रेस ओके सो टू गो टूगेदर वेल कॉम्प्लीमेंट इज ऑल्सो यूज एज अ वर्ब टू गो टूगेदर वेल ओके विथ समथिंग एल्स ठीक है complimenting clear yeah now other two which are short not very lengthy articles but good interesting ones please do read from 21st april guys it is already 21st april 2022 we have only 10 days remaining then you have may new month okay ignorance is not bliss okay we need to be aware of certain things ignorance is not bliss from indian express and in a free fall from indian express both are very good from indian express do read these and ironing out the other important idiom that we got is c i to i this was in your exam also last year c i to i iron out okay these are important phrases i think there was one more rope in rope in okay rope in attract try to um, convince someone to join you in a group 
रोप इन ओके ठीक है रोप इन देन वॉज देर एनी अदर आई एन आउट वी हैव रिटर्न सी आई टू आई वी हैव रिटर्न yeah simple phrases but you find these in your exam so you should remember okay sham ki class ecgc ke liye nahi hai sham ki class sab exams ke liye the kind of questions that i am getting it is valid for the practice session that i am doing at 5 pm i make sure i take questions a variety mix questions which is applicable for all your upcoming exams if you watch this watch the 5 pm class you will understand that okay now use code arshita for discount on olive board anything you buy on olive board you can use my code uh, also i have to inform you guys we have paid sessions plus ecgc pure descriptive and practice batch together is a new one check that out the details are on the website have a great day see you in the evening do come for evening session it is a good practice session you see the level of questions yesterday's class only check you will understand okay so all of you uh pdf of these articles so there are groups on telegram where you can get it pavitra okay not on my group because my group was already banned because of copyright issues i will not share newspaper pdf again you can always take subscription of these newspapers also right thank you guys for this class pdf okay i will be sharing it on my telegram group harshita kurana the grammar girl you can take it from there thank you thank you